Hello friends, welcome back to my tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to teach you how to create text animation motion pad in Autodex Maya. Uh, so this is what I'm going to teach you today. All right, when you run this, the text is going to circle around the earth. Okay. So let me start quickly. And save. And close this. All right. First of all, what you need to do is um, select this create, and then nerves primitive, and then select the circle. All right. Draw a circle here. Make sure that your circle is uh, is in the center of this point. Okay. So in order to do that, what you need to do is uh, make sure that uh, you highlight this this um, this three tab and press zero, enter. Okay. Now your circle is in the center of this point. All right. Now the next step. Come to create text. Select the box here. All right. When you select the box. You can type anything what you like here. Right now, I have written uh, weather report uh, create. Okay. Once you cl uh, click the create, it will your text will come here. Okay. So before we take any further step, what we need to do is just select the both uh, text and a circle here. Make sure that you put a frame of 300 or yeah, or anything you like, you can put 100 or 200 or 300. Right now, I'm giving 300. Right? Alright. So after this, what you need to do, come to the animation. Uh, before uh, before that, make sure that your uh, this option is in animation. Alright. Come to animate motion path. Alright. I'm gonna click this so that I'm gonna use again. again. Alright. Uh, once you click the motion pad uh, select this attach to motion pad okay after that um, once you once you click the attach to motion pad uh, the next step you need to do is uh, highlight both the highlight both the text and the circle here again all right and then uh, and then select the flow flow pad object. Okay. After that, uh, you you can see here a square. Actually, you want this text to run around the circle, but as of now, we are getting a square here, which is not supposed to be like this. Uh, but no worries. I'm gonna teach you uh, slowly and exactly how to do it. So. After this, uh, what you have to do is uh, uh, when I click this uh, object, okay. Uh, if you press S, then you can see here out here it will select all. Okay. Uh, go to your right click and key selected. Okay. Don't forget that. Once you did that, uh, make sure you come to your attribute, attribute editor. After that, you can, can you see the FFT one here? Select and uh, come come to your uh, latest history, which is like S division. Give a number of uh, 50. All right. See. Now, this text is going to be inside the circle. Okay. If you want more, you can give up. Oh, hundred here. I'm sorry. Hundred here. So it will it will look more uh, better. But for now, I'm gonna give fifty only. Just for uh, make it better clear. Now after that, you click to this text 
and you press your R here and make sure you uh, click this and move towards your left hand side once the text is inside the circle uh, leave your uh, left click mouse and then you can see here the text is inside the circle alright now if you want to check then you can run this and see whether it's running properly or not uh, it looks it looks good till now okay now you guys must be wondering what the hell is going on here alright no, don't worry uh, I have a solution for that uh, you just have to uh, pr uh, press Ctrl D for that to copy the text and then press uh, W and drag this out for a while ok now you can delete this there is no need to keep a copy of that so oh, I'm sorry mm, not that uh, delete this and this ok now in order to put back this text to the circle what you need to do is press your shift key and then select both the uh, object and uh, select the motion attached to motion path alright once you click the it, the text will go inside the circle automatically and run your uh, Maya again see now the text is not moving outside it's running properly inside the circle alright um, so what what's the next thing we need to do is stop for a while and then select your uh, spear here create one spear and let's make uh, uh, let's make this object as an earth alright in order to make this earth uh, go to the google and uh, Im search for the image like earth map you you'll find lots of options like this download any one of it and save in your desktop or whichever folder you like and after that go to your uh, right click and then assign new material plane and then choose the plane and select this this box here file again select this and then uh, I'm going to choose my image open this and then when you click when you press 6 you will find the image inside your art I mean inside the object alright so when you render this you can clearly see the art and the weather report alright but uh, if we put a color here then it may look more realistic and more proper so in order to do that just go to your click here once again uh, assign new material and plane and then click color here all right make sure you anything what color you like choose anything and then click out okay. all right that's it and now when you run this You can see the text running around the circle, around the earth properly. Okay. If you want to make the earth more bigger and and more inside a circle, proper circle, then uh, make sure you click the object and then highlight this and press zero and enter. All right. Now your earth is in the center of this part. Okay. So. Uh, I guess that's all if you liked my video please click like and subscribe uh, if you have any question please uh, email me or feel free to comment uh, uh, I'm sure I'll try to respond back as soon as possible thanks for watching goodbye